Hey everybody, Chance Priest here again for another film review. This time, a very, very special film review because this movie was made by a real good friend of mine, Theo Kane. And uh, he gave me early access to it, which I thought was pretty darn cool itself. Now, this movie's a daredevil movie, right? I mean, it's it's out there. It's daredevil. So I thought, what, what, where the hell better to do a review than the, the sixth story of my building in downtown Paris, Texas and a wasp just flew on the back of my head from them bushes. Whoo! Anyway, so, uh, I'm not gonna give away too much. I'm gonna have to give away a little bit, just so you know. Th this film's great, y'all. I mean, it's not one of those, oh, I know the guy who made this film, so it's good. It's one of those, shit, I won't watch it again. I mean, it, it, it was just total nonstop action. Uh, I'll be honest, I'll be honest y'all been there you know somebody gives you a movie and says oh watch that I made it or or watch that you know I saw it I was real skeptical real skeptical. you know I was like I was like I know Theo I know how talented he is but you know no matter how good you are sometimes it just don't all come together because it ain't all you right so I said man you know you know I'm, I'm so last night I was gonna wait till tonight to watch it but I said last night it was 1 a.m. and I said screw it I'm gonna watch it you know and uh, put on my headphones, started up. I actually had a pen and paper out. I thought, well, I'll draw a little while I'm watching it, you know? Um, Cause I do that. But anyway, from right the get go, the, the soundtrack is insane. It's as good as any professional Hollywood $10 billion movie you've ever seen. I'm serious, the, 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 the freaking soundtrack's insane. I had, I had headphones on and, and, and watching it on my phone and it was just nuts. Uh, so right off, low budget film, I mean, he did this all on his own money, you know. Low budget film, I'm thinking, you know, acting's gonna really, you know, be, dude, these guys were pros. The acting was awesome. Um, I don't, I never heard the word yayo, uh, but man, I'm gonna tell you what, you better get to know that word. Um, <laughs> It's got all the stuff that I love in a movie. It's got it's got great action. It's got real fight scenes, man. I mean, I mean, and I gotta know, I gotta know about them fight. I'll, I'll go with that later, but man, them fight scenes were ridiculous. It's got good old school 80s, 90s movie violence. You know, just crazy off the wall. Not gory. I mean, not to me, but man, it was good violence. I just couldn't get enough of it you know I, I just I really loved it add in science fiction which I love uh, yeah. and actually add in some horror I mean it's got I'm not trying to give it away but man I mean it's got you know Walking Dead and Frankenstein and 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 Star Wars and and, and you know the movie Cyborg with Jean-Claude Van Damme you got all that shit mixed in together um, I was so pumped. I, I mean, 10 minutes in, I was sold, man. I was, I was putting the pencil down and I'm sitting there watching it and these and and, and just the, the throbbing, the pumping. Um, one thing I have a big problem with in movies is, is, is 100 pound girls throwing around 250 pound guys because I don't care how good you are, it's impossible because I've been there, right? So there's a there's only there's one chick in here, you know, one you know, girl in the movie, and she's freaking awesome. She does, she's a can't give it away oh man all I can say is 50 BMG enough said over and over and over so awesome um, the uh, the of course we're in England right so just getting guns and doing all that stuff and I know Theo got arrested a bunch of times for having blanks and guns and all that stuff like that but it was so good it, the way they, they they moved the sound I mean everybody the guns the guns recoiled on them with the bucking the the shooting the splatter <sighs> I mean, man, I, I swear, I swear, I rented, I, I went to, I, I'm back in 1990, and I just went down to the, to the Lytle video where I used to shoot, go all the time, and, and I, and I, and I looked at the cover, and I said, damn, because, you know, his poster's off the hook, you know, um, so, you know, you see a, a killer movie cover on your VHS, and you're like, okay, I'm gonna rent that one, you know, and you go there with your buddies, and you slide it in, and you are laughing, and, and, and joking, and messing around, and the next thing you know, you are frozen to the TV, you know, oh hell yeah, you know, and, you, and then it's done. And then the next night, y'all, 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 y'all keep it, pay the late fees, and watch it again. 
I mean, that, that's how that's how good it was. I, I just I just can't say enough about this movie. Uh, and, and and all friendship aside, because I I I pan his ass because he he was a prick in the movie. Theo Theo acted in it, and he was a real prick. In fact, one, one of the big long scenes, he gets his ass beat from one end to another, and uh, and and I enjoyed it. Okay, now, he was a good guy, but boy, he was a pricky good guy, you know. So uh, so I love you, Theo. But man, ooh, I, 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 I you know glad to see the way it turned out, man. I'd like to see you get your ass kicked a little bit out there. Okay, anyway, so go to fight scenes. Everybody knows I'm a lifelong martial artist. I love martial arts. 90% of the time, movies got it all wrong. I mean, all wrong. Um, this was this was like borderline John Wick action. I'm telling you, it, it, they, they the, the editing, the, the the moves, the choreography, which I know is all Theo because he's a martial artist. It was just so dang good. And then incorpor incorporating WWF moves into it, steal my heart, man. I mean, it was killer. And and okay, Theo on that hur Hurricane Rana you did, did you hurt your right arm? Because I, I swear, I felt you. I, I saw injury to your right arm on that day. So I gotta know is that was that real or not? But anyway, um, and I'm sure you did it. It looked like you all the way through. I don't know. Did you have a stunt man? I don't know. Anyway, um, so it's not out on release yet. You know, um, it's coming out, and I don't know when Theo's release is, and I don't know if it's gonna be on Hulu. Would you, by God, it should be on Hulu, Netflix, the whole nine yards. Because if it ain't, there's something wrong with this world, people. Um, I know everybody knows I'm dying to get a movie made um, with my characters, and this inspired me more than I can say. It, it's it told me it told me yes you can, you know, and and man I tell you what it, it I mean this is I'm just thinking about all the scenes. Um, uh, of course, there's a robot on the on the on the. Uh, And um, yeah, he re he reminded me of the robot from uh, the Black Hole, you know. And so the robots, the robots in there quite a bit. I mean, you know, through, through certain scenes. And I loved the freaking robot. I loved the freaking robot more than I can express. I love the robot. Um, it should have been used more. Damn it! I know it's probably tough with all the you know the special effects and everything. But I mean. And we're talking this whole movie. We're not talking no CGI crap, man. We're talking the real deal, the way movies should be made. Um, love the robot. Love the chick with the 50. <laughs> uh, I love so much of it. I, I, I just... Uh, the, the, main, the main military bad guy, dude, he should be top-notch Hollywood, top-shelf stuff. Uh, but there's a lot of guys. There's there's so many guys in there. Uh, anyway, I can't like I promised him I wouldn't give it away because it's it's uh, it's uh, but the ending. This is what happened. No. <laughs> anyway, it was so freaking gay. It was great, 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 great. Um, I want to watch it again. In fact, my kids are going to watch it tonight, and and they 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 are now they might be 15, 17, but they are 80s and 90s action movie aficionados, and they. They will give, I'll guarantee, I, now I told them to be honest, but I guarantee you they're going to give their stamp of approval on this one. Um, it's just hard to believe this was made, Theo made this out of his own pocket. It is hard, and it took him many years to make it. It's hard to freaking believe, man. Um, in fact, the reason I'm up here is because I'm scared to death of heights. <laughs> I hate being up here. So I did it because I thought, man, Theo, that took balls. That movie took balls. And by God, so I said, I'm going to use a little balls. Ain't, ain't as much as you did, but, you know, at least to get up high and, and you know, do something. Um, like I said, it, everything from, from, and I, I can't get over the soundtrack. It, it carries you, it, it carries you through this movie just so, so well. Everything's so fluid. Um, uh, and it's just total nonstop action. I mean, I mean, if you got ADD, it, no, no, don't worry about it, because you're gonna be taken care of in this one, because you're just, I mean, you're frozen to the, I mean, every, and, and, I mean, it's got it all. I mean, explosions, chases, fighting, creature guys, uh, uh, try not to give it, robots, at least one. Um, and it's post-apocalyptic, so it's uh, it's it's kind of a 
well, there's a building over there that's pretty post-apocalyptic, you know, so it's kind of like that. Anyway, uh, man, oh, I cannot wait to watch it. I'm gonna watch it with the kids tonight. So freaking awesome. I'm gonna put it on the, I watched it on the phone. We're gonna put it on a laptop or something because that's what I gotta do. I don't have all the, I'm not too technical, y'all know that. Anyway, so this, this, this movie gets two thumbs up and a big V for victory because man, Theo, you did it. This thing is awesome.